Frank and Camilla, welcome back uh, to the episode of Frank and Frank Man, Frank C. Um, today, uh, I just want to do a, a quick review on a scent that just came in um, a couple days ago. Uh, I've been watching it for a long time. Um, and that scent is, is from the Spanish house of uh, Lueve. This is Lueve Siete Anonimo. Lueve Seven Anonimo. Um, this is, you know, just the bottle itself is a great bottle, uh, very reminiscent of the Aqua Dijo Profumo bottle, and I'm going to touch on this in a little bit. Um, but with this, this is a very incense-driven scent. Uh, incense is one of my favorite uh, scent, uh, notes in perfumery, and with this, um, and you know, that, that this, this is what it is to me. It's just straight. Uh, it's lavender. It's lavender in here. It's like seven. I mean, it's just great stuff. Um, it starts off with a little bit of, um, you know, there's seven ingredients in here. It starts off with a little green. There's leather in here too. It starts off with a little green. Like right now, it's kind of in this green stage. But uh, after about half an hour to an hour, it dies down to just straight incense, lapping them. Um, and that and that that's what I get with Aqua de Jo Profuma. With, with, with this, Aqua de Jo Profuma is what is one of my favorites. Uh, as you can see, I've probably used about 60 percent of the bottle at this point. I've had this bottle for about two years. But with this, with Aqua de Jo Profumo, incense being incense is at the base. Uh, start this one starts off fresh. It's bergamot in here, other 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 fresh notes, and then it dies down uh, on my skin. It, skin, it, it uh, you know, it doesn't die down. It, it projects really. Like this is a, um, I've heard they've they might have i don't know if not reformulated they might have made it less potent but this this bottle is from about two years ago so i i think uh this one i mean it's very potent put a couple sprays on it just projects and projects projects for a good three hours before it dies down and then when it dies down that's when the incense comes out um but it's just fresh 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 incense at the base uh aqua de, aqua de profumo uh this is just this, this is just um you know any season, any reason, any day, you know, day, night, work, home, wherever. This is just any season, any region type of scent. Aqua de Jo Profumo, uh, one of my favorites. Um, and I, I've talked about this before in other videos, so just um, check that out. Uh, with this one, with, with uh, Siete Lewebe, Anonimo, um, is, this is the base of that. It's, it's incense, it's, like I said, it's green. Starts off green, I mean, it's smoky, that balsamic smokiness. And then after about a good half hour to an hour, because like I said, I've, this is my third straight day wearing it, so now I feel like I should, should talk about it. Um, it dies down to that incense base, and that's what you have for the life of the scent. Um, you know, so, so, like a beautiful bottle. I, I like it a lot. And, you know, I, I, I knew it was going to be good, and it, it turned out to be it turned out to be good, so... Uh, from the house of uh, uh, Lueve, it's the Seven Anonimo. Just want to do a quick review. Uh, this is probably, probably going to be in my fall list. Um, yeah, it'll probably most likely be my fall list. You know, you know, this uh, time of year is the best time of year to start wearing your incense scents. Um, you know, and I love incense. So th this is this is my uh, impression of uh, Lueve Seven Anonimo. Is an incense? Is their take on incense? And it reminds me a lot of this one. Aqua de Jo Profumo, but this one, whereas this one's fresher, uh, this one is a little darker because it's, it's it's a leather accord in this one. Um, so uh, seven seven ingredients in, in this one, including incense. That's what's called the Weber Siete. Okay, Fragrance Amelia, uh, thank you for all the support. Thank you for your for your subs. Thank you for your comments. Uh, please keep them coming. Uh, my fall list is going to be coming up soon, so uh, I just wanted to kind of touch base with you on this one come outside on the deck and just um you know share the share this scent with you um yeah, if you see it it's, it's definitely worth picking up and um i actually sent the moments um Jalima talk, spoke about this a few weeks ago um at that point i had I, I, I think like the day before i had ordered or ordered it so it was in the air when he, when he spoke about it but uh great great scent if, if you see it out there and you're an incense lover like me, definitely worth, worth picking up. So, pray for Amelia. Until next time, take care.